Hey, what's up guys? It's Sami again here. Let me say it's Armin again here because Armin is my uh, first name and Sami is a combination of my son name and myself. And I'm using that as a programming name. Okay, today is uh, today is a Sunday, 20 November 2022 and again from Netherlands. As you remember, uh, in the last video, we made a, a video about uh, here about implementation in blockchain and Bitcoin. And in that video, we we made a wallet with private key. But today, I've got uh, some message say, okay, if we have that private key, let me run program. Take a look here. Uh, if you take a look here, we have here uh, private key everything. I say here this is a Bitcoin address that is started one. Okay, let's check that in uh, Blockchain Explorer. See, that's a valid address zero zero zero. Okay, this is a valid address. I say okay. Uh, I want now test how I am be able. This is my public address, which is you give and people as bitcoin wallet to send and receive and here i have also private key okay this is private key and now uh, let's imagine okay i have i save this private key and and you know that if i close this program and run it again everything going to change okay let's do it again do it again completely uh, change see wallet address change private key change everything but the last wallet last wallet which was this now we want let's imagine like this sami uh, i lost my everything i lost uh, my wallet i lost my telephones everything but the only things what i have is this private key and now we want to see how we are be able to drive to the public uh, uh, address only with private key okay it say private key you have to to take it just private you have to put it somewhere like a password or something like this if someone has access to this it means it has access to to your uh, financial things okay this was the code uh, you can find it in the last video uh, and now here and now here we want we want to see how how we get that address back okay i say here what i know for sure here i have a private key i copy that i say here uh, where my private key is equal to a string because that is in the first place that's just a string okay i say okay this is my private string which i've saved okay and here i say here uh, again where uh bitcoin secret for example is equal to new bitcoin we we, we are going to to make a, a, a object of this uh, bitcoin is this class okay bitcoin secret uh bitcoin secret and bitcoin secret takes two arguments you say key and network key is my private key okay key is my private key and which network as you know network main network dot main okay that is this here i say hey this is my private key and you now drive my old address okay and, and here i say var address is equal to bitcoin secret bitcoin secret dot get address and here uh, a script pop key a script uh, pop uh, key type dot legacy uh, if you ch if you uh, change this you never get that because these are a uh, different type of hashing algorithm that that, that, that one use big that's why some of addresses start with bc some i say here legacy uh, we are talking about this later and network is just main network okay network is main network 
Bitcoin secret dot pop key uh, dot pop key dot get address here and here uh, close it for me and console console dot right line uh, address for me what I want to see here now I want with my private key drive to my address which is uh, this one I want to see my address here as output let's see uh, oh yeah okay run it you see here one hw and here one hw one car you see exactly the same address and that is, that is, they say that this is one way cryptography. It say with that key you drive this public key, but from this public key you never drive to that address. That's why you have to remember, you have to save private key. And like this, uh, I am owner of this address because I have private key. You know? Okay, guys. That was the second part that was really, uh, really uh, need to this because uh, like this you identify your user, something like that. And that was part two and I see you in the uh, third part. Have a nice day. See you next one.